happening, folks? Jero here, aka AJ from 90, coming at you with another reaction, another Marvin Gaye reaction. But this is this is him doing the national anthem in 1983. And I've heard this before, but a long time ago. But I don't think even then I've seen the video for it. So this will be the first time in that. And kind of a um, remembrance of it. So so excited to get to that. But before we do, need you guys to go ahead and subscribe. Ring that bell for notification. Let's go for the channel in terms of subscribers. It's 10,000. We can get there, but I'm going to need your help to do it. And so now, without further ado, this is Marvin Gaye performing the national anthem live. Can you see Nothing has made it more clear that it's been a million years since I've seen that performance in full as when you're watching it for the first. And that's like, I forgot. You don't remember where it's going. You don't, I'm, I'm going to have to, I'm going to have to rip that audio and make it a part of my rotation. That was so good. Um, he made the national anthem sexy. He made it sexy. That was hot. That, but that was, that sounds like the, um, sexual healing sessions right there, <laughs> man. That was really good. Whew. So Whitney's 91 version is like, it's my favorite, but this is up there. This is like top two or three. And it's like, how could it not? Because he completely, completely rearranged it and made it his own. And you don't, you don't have that much with the national anthem. You really don't. No one today is messing with that. <laughs> so man, Marvin, Marvin is special. Marvin, that was him. That was Marvin's way. Whew. Really loved that. Really loved that. What is your thoughts of the Marvin Gaye version. I always loved to, um, my mom and my dad both separately always talk real. They both have, and in my dad's case, had a deep love of Marvin Gaye and they both have like the same thing of like, Oh, when he did that, Oh my God. <laughs> and so I remember, I'll never forget the first time I saw this in that if, I knew what they meant. I knew what they went. Well, I knew exactly what both of them meant. So, yeah, this this was great. What was your thoughts on the first time you heard this? And you know, uh, Marvin, rest in peace, Marvin. And 
who the music world we we had him for a very long time well i say i say we but he was gone before my time he was gone a good like six years before my time but <laughs> but the world had his music for a long time and i'm grateful that he has a fantastically large discography that he left behind that i very much love he's so anyway i hope you enjoyed this reaction if you did please go ahead like subscribe bring that bell for notification let's go for this channel in terms of subscribers is 10,000. we can get there but i'm gonna need your help to do it if you want to follow me on social media that's in the description below if you'd like to donate or tip that's also in the description below if you see that heart thing you can hit a tip on there and i i encourage you to do that with all the youtubers that you appreciate that you love because this is not easy also in that you can sponsor a request if there's a request for like sexual healing or what's going on that you want to see like tomorrow let me know and it'll it'll happen <laughs> it'll happen i will get it up as soon as i can and um you can also join my Patreon. That's also in the description below. But become a patron on the Patreon. On there, you're going to get early access to videos like these. You're going to get Patreon-only videos like these. And your requests, your messages, your comments, all that stuff. They have a priority there over everywhere else because Patreon helps fund the life. And that is important. So shout out to my patrons. And above all else, thanks to every one of you for watching. And please take care of yourself and each other. I can feel